Pisces. Anyway, hopefully, I don't know what happened in the, I don't know where it left off or what it, what happened with the last reading. But anyway, um, I asked the guy if he, you know, knew anything about manifesting. I think y'all heard all of that. But anyway, now into the general reading. This is what you're attracting right now. Once you allow yourself to get into this flow, Pisces. So there's something that you need to stop doing. Or you need to have more patience about something. I feel like that there's something that you stop doing that leads you to that leads you on the right path. You started with the Ten of Pentacles, which is your abundance. And it's connected to you being in the flow connects you to your inner power and your confidence, which connects you to this abundance, right? There's a chance that you're going to take on yourself. And I feel like it involves you stopping something or ending something or slowing something. I feel like it's a stop with something. It puts you on the right path, and I mean it's going to happen fast with this tower, right? There's somebody who either keeps their eye on you or there's somebody that you always felt like you had to keep an eye on. They, either they do more watching than acting or this has been somebody this has been somebody that let's see this is Pedro Soros about I mean who has time Who has time to keep dealing with somebody who's unfaithful, who's unstable, whether it's financially, in love, whatever this is, Pisces, or who's always trying to make a decision when the decision is clear? Or maybe this is you. Is this you? No. They still sitting there trying to make a decision why I don't think you're thinking about it anymore because I don't think you've left this person a choice. You've already evolved. You've already made a decision. I don't think they're in on this. I don't think they know that you've already done this. And that's why they're still trying. That's why they're trying to reel you back in. Okay. But they still hide in their hand. They're showing up as every king in the reverse. This person is very burdened by you. I feel like you making a player want to fall in love with you, or you, you, you've made someone want to be in a commitment with you. <laughs> what made them come to this with them showing up in the reverse? I... Somebody's coming to you after the fact. It's like now they want this commitment after you've broken up with them due to all of their fuckery, okay? After you're no longer willing to invest in this person. What's the energy between the two of you currently? Oh, this person is manifesting you big time. This person has a lot of deep feelings for you, but I also feel like you... You've de you're developing a lot of you're developing deeper feelings for yourself, Pisces. Two of Cups in the reverse at the bottom. This this is about you. Like this chapter of your life, it's about you. It's all about you developing deeper feelings for yourself, and it's bringing you to a calmer place in your mind and in your life. And it's eliminating this drama that whoever this was was bringing to the table. It's King of Wands in the reverse, and y'all dealing a Leo. <laughs> and it was nothing but stress, sleepless nights, thoughts that were just like, maybe this person's chaotic mindset was trying to get on you or did get on you. And the, especially the more that you connect with someone sexually. But you're standing your ground against this person now. Hmm. You were dealing with somebody who was very selfish. This person is very unhappy without you. 
They know that they created a lot of fucked up memories between the two of you, and they think they don't have a shot in hell with actually making this work with you again, but that is not going to stop them from trying. They know that they have to make, I'm hearing a complete life change. I mean, they're going to have to throw their whole life away in order to make this happen with you, and they want that because of the connection that they feel with you. They ain't going to get it nowhere else, Pisces. This person sees you as their fortune. This person is seeing you as the queen of pentacles, okay? But the way that they made you feel was the queen of swords. And the, wait, wait, wait. Is this you? Mm-mm. Is this you? You letting whatever this situation, that this is a person. You letting this person go, or you like really just throwing your hands up with the situation. I feel like you went in steps, Pisces. I feel like you went from resentment to insecurity, to codependency, to just focusing on your bag, your stability, your overall like foundation. You may have gone through a little bit of bitterness, but at some point you went cold. And maybe you needed to go cold so that you could create that disconnect. And now you're the empress. Good things come to me easily and often. And now this person's looking like a damn fool because they never quite stepped up to the plate and they've missed out on an opportunity, but two of you are no longer connected in the way that they would like you to be connected. And it could be because you found out this person was giving their attention to others or they just weren't they always is what I'm hearing. This person was sending out signals. You know, you know how people, um, you know, I, I feel like this is somebody who either they were always it's like they were always putting their seed out there. I don't know if they was putting their seed out there in a way of like actually putting their seed out there or they like to keep several things going. You know what I mean? Never quite want to end up empty handed. And that could have just been the betrayal in itself. It's like you don't even act like you in a relationship when you are. People overestimate their importance. Like Tyler said, trying to be important. You're not. You'll never be important enough to keep fucking me over. Sorry, you're not cute enough. Your dick ain't big enough. Your wop ain't wet enough. None of that. <laughs> Nobody wants something that's for everybody. Everybody likes exclusive shit. You don't want to walk in a club and have the same outfit on as somebody else. I mean, it's just what it is. So I don't know why people think that they're important enough to think that I'm not sharing a motherfucking thing. I mean, I'm going to share. You know, but you know what I mean. I'll share my food with you. <laughs> you know what I mean? But there's certain shit people just not going to share. And this person thought they was way more important than they was. They thought they was way more fly than they was. They just, they thought. Until they met you. <laughs> I'm hearing until they experienced you. And it's really, it's really messed this person's head up in a big way. So, Pisces. The lighting's better on here anyway. I'm really sorry for this shitty connection at this place. And hopefully this video uploads quickly. Okay. dealing with an Aquarius, okay? So I do feel like, like I said, the number 17 could be significant. 
Uh, I feel like a lot of you are letting go before you get pulled back into a messed up situation or a situation that stole your mental peace. You're manifesting clarity at this point. The love that you share for yourself. The, the love that you share with yourself, Pisces, is going to make you realize you wasn't, in, you wasn't as in love as you thought you was. You might have been in lust. You might have been in whatever they were in. Okay. And it's 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 like it's gonna dawn on you the more that, that the more that you keep pouring that love into yourself, it's like pushing you towards the right path. And you going you gonna run away from this person. It's gonna happen out of nowhere. And the thing about it is they had they had how can I say Somebody was either lazy, I'm getting like pity party. It's like you could have done something about this. Like you actually could have done something about this and you did nothing. I even told you what to do. I even, I even gave you suggestions on what you should do. And normally, I don't, I don't, you know, if you don't already know what to do, you told this person. Some, I don't know if you showed them or you told them what could happen in order to work this out and they just didn't do it and so you're not moving forward with them but you some of you may be very good at playing chess some of you are very studious some of you are looking for i feel like this person, yep, that's exactly what it is. They want to step up and do the right thing. They want to study. They don't want this to be over. They watching you. And, hmm. But it's their, it's their manipulative, blah, blah, manipulative. What else is connected to this? I'm hearing unemotional. And then too emotional. This is what you're walking away from. You've made a decision. I can't go nowhere with this fickle ass bullshit. I can't do this. The more when it was, it wasn't until it was too late. It wasn't until you was done that this person, or it won't be until you're completely done, that this person wants to come back and do the right thing. And how unattractive is that? When you had the chance to do something. You had a chance to do something to make this work. You had the key right in front of you. And you just sat there and put your head in your lap instead of going and grabbing the key and working this shit out with me. You've had your chance at the mic. Keep investing in yourself, Pisces. This situation that you've gone through is just one moment in time. So imagine yourself in that suit, you know, with your shirt open about right, right down there. Okay, nice little abs showing your little chest, your little cleavage, whatever you got going on. Imagine yourself with a tan. Look at this tan, at it. Look at this tan. The skin is giving. Imagine yourself smoking on expensive cigars. Imagine yourself in that gown. Imagine yourself on that flight. Imagine yourself on that vacation. Imagine yourself on that stage. Imagine yourself in that car. Imagine yourself with them kids. Imagine, you know what I'm saying? The list goes on. I can go on and on. Pisces, y'all getting some extra love from me and I feel like from somebody else. The part of you that wasn't healed was the part of you that couldn't imagine yourself with somebody else or somebody different, somebody that looked different, somebody that, that had sex with you different, somebody, you know. And the thing about that was you wasn't even in chemistry with this person anymore. Y'all wasn't even truly getting to know each other anymore because there was so many lies covering up shit. Now it's time for you to free yourself from that shit, Pisces. Because sometimes we, we, we look up and we realize we're not even in love. I'm here. we're not making love no more. We don't even. Something like that. You got to love yourself first. You got to start enjoying the moment. There's somebody coming into your life. Okay, this is what it is. This person is coming back. You don't, I don't feel like you've completely forgiven them. And 
you not forgiving them ain't gonna do you no good, right? This person wanna marry you. It's like, now I wanna come back and do the right thing and not be deceptive, but you still looking at them like, yeah, okay. Pisces. That anguish that you feel is your realignment, okay? This person wasn't nothing but talk, 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 words, 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 okay? This is somebody who is like a proverbial, a proverbial dance away lover. You know what I mean? You should t you should heed their warning, Pisces. This is somebody that doesn't want you to know everything about them. So fuck them. All right. You don't want me to know everything? Cool, 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 cool. <laughs> I'll go be with somebody who wants to know me, and you know what I'm saying? It's not like I'm optionless out here in these streets. Okay, stop overestimating your importance. Honey, anybody, I told somebody today, anybody can be replaced. Only thing that you can't really replace is good energy from a specific individual. You know what I'm saying? It's like, I can't replace, you can't replace my good energy. You're not going to find this energy nowhere else because I'm the only person who has this who has my own set of, of skills, experiences. Like, I'm my own fingerprint you're not gonna find another journey specifically but you can find another toxic bitch you can find uh you can find some different pussy you can find another big dick I mean, they're everywhere just go to the south <laughs> i'm just playing i'm not playing anyway um there's a person like i said this warns you that you are by danger affected be careful who you have around you but in a happy environment, from harm, you will be protected. The number 10, this could be the ending for you, okay, with somebody. I feel like a lot of you are just putting your sword down. I don't want to fight no more. I don't want to do this no more. I, it's not, I don't want to play no more. It's not fun. <laughs> I see. So I'm going to leave it there, okay? Some of y'all may have a willow tree near you, too. Some of y'all may believe in ghosts or you've seen ghosts or something like that. And it could be something significant about a handbook or a journal. Maybe you need to start journaling your thoughts again. I'm hearing again. Anyway, you're a winner, Pisces. Winner, winner, chicken dinner. I love you guys. Like, share, and subscribe if this resonated with you. I'm so sorry for the pause out. I'm about to post this now. I'll see you in the next one. Ciao.